Okay, so <laughs> just got the call from Alberton that there are some cows loose on the road. So we're going to do what we do, which is go check and see if they are ours. So I thought I'd bring you along. Okay, so this just happened. Robin was out editing a short and she just come running in the house and <coughs> I got cows, double bridges, but I just saw them. So they took off because I was using the bathroom. So I figured I'd grab the camera and see if I can't locate them. One to two, three or four. Yeah, I just put it in my back pocket. Um, what's up? Is they are they ours? Negative, they are not ours. We are waiting for the county to get here, over. Well that's good. Whew, okay. <laughs> not our cows. <laughs> there is nothing like getting a call first thing in the morning. <laughs> Your cows are out. They're not our cows. <laughs> but thank God they are not our cows. But we are waiting for Elbert County to get here because there are quite a few of them. There's some calves and stuff out. So we're just going to sit here and do the neighborly thing, which is kind of wait and see if, because our county is known for helping round animals up. So if they need help, we'll definitely do that with them. So here's to not having cows out at 8 a.m. on a Sunday. <laughs> What is your location? I am walking to you. The same pasture where ours have been before, right on the corner of Double Bridges and Harmony Road. Roger that. I'll try to get a hold of Pete or Mr. Sid. All right, so we're here at the corner of Double Bridges and the road that we live on, Harmony. We're gonna make this left because they're right up here. And uh, whew. waiting on Mr. Pete now to come. I done got my 10,000 steps in for the day by the time this is going to be over. Elbert County Sheriff's Department's here, so we're going to be good neighbors like we talked about the other day on the live stream. So here's our buddy Pete. It looks like what's happened is, is that this property on the corner they run cattle here but the guy doesn't live super close so we're just going to do the neighborly thing and kind of push everything back so we're walking the fence line to try and see if we can figure out where these cows got out the owner still hadn't made it up here yet because um, he's coming from a good distance away and these guys look like they're getting a little restless so we're trying to see if we can find out where they got out it looks like they're going to tell us here in a second because as we're walking they're starting to push back towards the corner so it's almost like they know that they need to go back <laughs> okay so once we started to push them they're literally just walking right over the fence so there's there's two spots it looks like that are down and so the cows are just kind of one by one walking over so we're just gonna kind of sit here and wait to see what happens she looks like she's pregnant she is. <clears throat> yeah yeah uh -huh. there you go go on over you know the way you got out now get back on over there the gate's not even secure. No, the pole snapped. Completely gone. Yeah, look at that. Gone now. Gone now. Be careful. There you go. Okay, now this is going to be the fun part. Come on, little one. I, I don't. There you go. jump over the cow jumped over the moon let's go there you go there you go up oh, up oh, up oh. there you go there you go uno mas come on dummy I'm 
trying very slowly. Yeah. Yeah. Don't you come after me. There you go. That's a good boy. And that is how it's done. Okay, so it's time to head back to the house. Start the rest of our day. We're just kind of waiting because when I pulled in, I pulled into the driveway and kind of blocked in by the deputy. <laughs> so I can't tell you how relieved it is to know that they weren't ours. If you've ever had livestock, and you've had them out it can be a huge stress it takes a whole part out of your day because once you get them back then you got to figure out where they got out so i'm really not envying this this guy because he's got several places he's got to fix so we're gonna head back to the homestead try to make the most out of the rest of our day and <laughs> we just want to thank you guys for coming along with us god bless and have a nice day